Okay, this video is about how to choose the correct case for your phone. Alright, so I recently bought this case for my K7 LG and you know it fits fine. It's a two-part case. Let me show you. It recently broke right here. And let me show you it's a two-part case like a lot of them are. But this one's a little different. It's pretty cool. I liked it because the phone actually slides on this part first. Pretty easy. And then snaps into this part. Well, it recently broke and through me evaluating the different cases I've ever had, you know they have the rubber ones, rubber cases. Um, this is a hard plastic with a little bit of rubber on it, okay? But majority of it's hard plastic. Um, if this had been a gel one, this wouldn't have happened. It did, however, save my phone. My phone is not broken. The case, who cares is. You know, these are seven bucks. You know, these are, you know, hundred. For this one's like 150, but yeah. So, you know, in comparison, you'd rather go through 10 cases in one phone, but I would always suggest getting a jelly rubber bounce type thing more than once. This is actually like for one time deal. Um, once it's broke, you know, it's really no good. And this didn't take a heavy, heavy fall, but it, you know, it definitely took a fall out of my pocket. Out of my pants pocket, not my jacket, but yeah, it took a fall, hit the concrete. There you go. So it did its job. Happy about that. It's got to go get another one, but the thing is, you want to get a case that you can use again and again. You know, it's you can use it drop after drop after drop. You know, this one, Coverware. <laughs> It's made, this one's made by Coverware, this case, but it's a hard case. Um, yeah, I was really impressed with the case when I got it. Another thing was is the charging port. I had to cut out the charging port uh, flat for it because when you open the flat and go to put the charger in, it was actually pressing against the cord and it broke the cord. It actually, the rubber piece was so strong it actually broke the cord. This one's still here as you see. It was just that basically. Alright guys, so there's my tips on how to pick the best case for your phone. You're going to want one that's going to drop again and again. It can handle the abuse. One time drop cases, they look good, but you know, they kind of suck. They're good for one time, but they did the job. Bad thing about the rubber ones though, if you plan on putting this directly in your pocket, the rubber ones are hard. If you got a phone call and you want to get to your phone and get it out, Man, you might miss your call because you cannot get it out of your pants pocket because it actually grips the inside of your pocket. That's why I like the ones that actually clip on your belt. I don't have to put it in my pocket. I'd rather have it on my belt side, on my side, at my convenience. So, all right, guys, if you like this video, give me a uh, give me a, if you like this video at any given time, please give me a thumbs up. If you want to 